All right, what up, people? Welcome back to the channel. Hopping right back into some more Road of the Show, playing the Marlins again. Dude, I swear, something is so messed up with the Brave schedule because we play one team, and then literally, like, the next video, we're playing them again. It makes no sense. It just happened with, I think, the Nationals, where we had two four-game series in a row against them, or I guess we played four, had a three-game series against somewhere, someone else, and then played four against them again. It makes no sense. Whoever scheduled this, and, of course, the guy robs me. Oh, my God. What a brutal start to the episode. God dang it. My batting average is going lower and lower. What is it right now? 691. Yeah, we're about 10 points off from a 700 batting average. And uh, it's not looking good. It is not looking good. 700 might just be a little bit too difficult to get to, even though we can still do it. Don't get me wrong, but it's tough, bro. You have to go at least like three for four every single game to uh, to keep the batting average up. Like if you go three for five, your batting average goes down. If you go two for four, it goes down. So it's pretty brutal to get a 700 batting average, but we're still going to try. We just need to stop getting out. That's pretty much all we can control is uh, not getting out, even though it sucks because that at bat right there, we hit a home run. We hit a home run, and the guy caught it. So... Yeah, that's pretty brutal, but as long as we hit the ball good, every at-bat, oh my god, that is two this game, where we hit it very good and we're out, dude. Uh, I don't know. I mean, as long as we hit the ball good, this is what I was saying before uh, we hit that line drive, but as long as we hit the ball good, I've said that about ten times, we will be fine, okay? If we avoid hitting like weak ground balls or pop-ups in the infield and stuff like that, I think our batting average should get uh, should get up to 700 because, like, all those line drives, usually you get a hit. I would say you get a hit more than 70% of the time when you hit the ball hard, which is what we're going for here. So, yeah, if we can just avoid the weak ground balls, the fly balls, all that, we should be good. And look at this, bro. The Marlins are smashing us right now. 6-2. to two. Are you kidding me? No. Mighty, let's get a home run right now. And I really hope one of these games, we get a lot of good wind blowing out to, uh, like, left center field or something. Because, dude, the last, like, 20 games at Nuketown, the wind has been terrible. Like, if you guys haven't been watching, we haven't had a great opportunity for a 550-foot home run in a long time. And it's brutal. But we got to get a hit right here. Try to save the batting average a little bit and go three for five. Even though that is a 600 batting average, that will still help us out when that ball is launched. Let's go. Uh, what is that going to hit the house? No. Makes it to the bleachers out there in right center field. Um, are we going to end up catching up? We do not, obviously. I didn't think we were going to win. 10-6. to six, The Marlins showed up today, but they're not going to win anymore because we're going to win the next two, guaranteed. But their team did pretty good, dude. Grady on their team went 4-4. Four for four. Not bad, bro. Not bad, but let's keep going. Let me get a lot of wind. Default, advance. I almost selected pitching. That was very stupid. That would have really sucked. But let's go. Where's the wind? Blowing in from left. Oh, my God. No, and my batting average still at 491. We need a 5-for-5 five five performance right now, Mighty. All right, let's go. No, screw that. The last two games of this episode, this one and the next one, let's go a combined 12-for-12. 12 12. We need six at-bats in each game, which is going to be pretty tough because I rarely get six at-bats in a game. So... That's getting pretty uh, pretty greedy, asking for six, but I want it, okay? I want 12 hits in a row. Let's go. Let's go. Getting a lot of fielding situations. This always happens, I swear. Like when the uh, like when we really need to focus on hitting, which is like right now. Dude, how, <laughs> how am I catching that ball? That is definitely the third baseman's ball right there. But um, when I really need to focus on hitting in situations where, let's say, the wind's blowing out by a lot, they give me 10 million ground balls. Or right now where I'm trying to get as many hits as possible to raise the batting average. They uh, make me wait 30 minutes between at-bats and it works every single time. Oh my god, line drive to short. Brutal. Brutal, okay. No more getting out this episode. I mean, that was not a good hit. That line drive, I mean, technically it was a line drive. But we really didn't hit it good at all. Like, it wasn't really that fast off the bat, so... Yeah, that was just overall a terrible hit. We need to get a hit, though, right now. Go two for three, and maybe we'll get one more at-bat. Oh, my God. We roll over, but we're getting a base hit on it. Dude, it's two to nothing. 
Marlins, how do you guys keep beating us? Come on, Braves, please. Do we legit might not get another at-bat? We might get three at-bats. I'm pretty sure I'm the only one with a hit. Oh, my God. This is so bad. Bro, I bet we have two hits as a team. This is literally so bad. Bottom of the ninth. We have five hits, bro. What is happening? Dude, I swear, if the Braves don't win a World Series this year, I will throw up and we hit a weak fly ball. Oh, my God. And look at what it is. An off-speed pitch inside. That is my biggest weakness. I've said this 10 million times. Curveballs, sliders, change-ups, whatever it is. Any off-speed pitch inside, I always mess up, bro. It is terrible, dude. I am so bad at hitting off-speed inside, as you see right there. Um... We go two for four with two singles. Potentially the most boring game of all time. The Marlins starting pitcher threw a complete game shutout against us. That is literally so bad, but we got one more game here. We better do good. If we do bad here, is that a sweep? Yeah, we lost game one. Dude, we're about to get swept by the freaking Marlins. No. Where's the wind? No wind. Of course not. Dude, Nuketown is not producing good opportunities for us as we hit another line drive to someone. Um, That definitely put our batting average below 690. Yeah, 688. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Seven to nothing. Dude, we're getting swept. We're definitely getting swept. Dude, what is the Marlins doing that is making them so good? Like, bro, what are they doing? 487, good hit. Number 242 on the year. Okay, 7-3. to three. We're catching up a little bit, but it's already the bottom of the sixth inning. Get out. Please don't catch it. Don't catch it. It's gone. We're going to guess the distance. 409. Come on. Get, let me guess. Let me guess it. 409. 423. How is that 423? I don't get it, bro. This, this stadium is so hard to guess the distance. We're only down by two now. Can we please... Get one more at bat and maybe walk it off. That would be insane. Oh, my God. It gets through. We almost made an amazing play. First and second with one out. Don't do it, Marlins. Oh, my God. 11 to 5, bottom of the eighth. We are literally going to get swept. Good hit, Mighty. Dude, this is so depressing. Oh, my God. We are getting swept by the freaking Marlins. Yep. It happened. That is uh that is not good. That is not good. Um I want to return in the clubhouse and see what their record is because it can't be good. Like we potentially just got swept by the worst team in the league. Um Yeah, I don't even know what to say. Um what the f? Dude, literally what the f? I swear if we start hitting bad and losing games at the end of the year and don't get any of these records we wanted, which is like a 700 batting average and then like 130 wins. I'm going to be so mad. Yeah, the Marlins, bro. 52 and 67. They suck. They suck. And they just swept us, dude. Oh my God. They are on a pretty solid win streak, though. Six wins in a row. Even though um, they're eliminated from the division, uh, we literally just have to win, win one more game in the entire rest of the year, or the Nationals just have to lose one more game and we clinch the NL East. So we're doing very good. But God dang it, dude. Hang on. So how many wins can I get now? Um, Hang on a second. It's loading. Hang on. Let me pull out the calculator. So 162 times 0.824. Boom. Okay, so we're still on pace for like 133 wins, which is still very good. But uh, I want to get... Yeah, I just want to win 130. I think 130... Would be a very good win-loss ratio. So, like, 130 wins, 32 losses. That's a pretty solid season right there. And maybe one of these games coming up, we can go 20 for 20 and uh, increase the batting average a lot and hit a 550-foot home run at Nuketown, okay? But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button. We're almost to September, and then we have October, and then, uh, obviously, the playoffs start then. So, yeah. We got this uh, this World Series coming up, and then I guess we got our final season, which honestly, I better get going because it's already, what, the 6th of March, and the new game comes out in like 24 days. So 
Are we going to be able to crank out a full season in like 20 days? I hope so, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video again. Smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.